Hi friends, my name is Claire and I scored some major deals on Thrifted Yarn today, so please stick around. Hi friends, my name is Claire and this is my channel, Woodshed Theory. Here, I make content about what it is like to live as an adult on the autism spectrum and whatever else feels good to me. So if that sounds good to you, or if you're feeling particularly gracious today, and I hope that you are, go ahead and click the subscribe button, ring the bell. I almost forgot to mention that I put out videos a few times a week. Click the like, click the like. Friends, why am I coming to you looking like hot garbage? Well, I went out to buy hair dye and I didn't want to shower before then because it's better to dye dirty hair. On my way to buy hair dye, I was in the area of a large thrift store that I have heard about but hadn't been to before. So I decided that I was going to stop in. My friends have told me about this thrift store before and they've even gotten me things from this thrift store, but I have never been in myself. I heard that they rarely have yarn. I have a friend who got some once, but she has told me that they never have good yarn. So, you know, don't even really look. But today I went in and they had a whole bucket, bucket? tote. They had a tote full of yarn and I'll put a picture up here. So again, I wasn't necessarily planning on buying any yarn, but I wanted to see what they have because I always want to check and see what thrift stores have because I want you to know that if you want to collect yarn like me, you don't have to spend a ton of money and I spent hardly any money on this. So I'll show you what I got. First thing that I picked up is going to look like a mess, but I knew what it was when I saw it. So it's got some brown in there and blue. It's really pretty roving. I am about 100% sure, 99% sure that this is Unforgettable by Super Saver. Um, I've never used it before, but I have seen it in the store an awful lot. And they had 99 cents on this and it's an entire bowl. bowl. Entire ball, wow. Speech therapy didn't help me much. Entire ball for 99 cents. And I thought uh, it would be a good one to pick up because if you know yarn and you know what you're looking for, then you could get a good deal on something. And these normally run for $5.99 if they're not on sale. Similar yarns are uh, Landscapes and that one's by Lion Brand. And I know that Michaels just came out with Fusions? What's it called? Anyway, um, but usually full price $5.99, a dollar. Great deal. I think it's 100% acrylic and a, and probably like a three to four weight roving. So not a bad find. Worst thing I found, because it doesn't have a label. Next two, never saw this brand before. This one has the label and this one doesn't but because of how this is wrapped, it's two full skeins, I can tell. Somebody started something with this and then unwrapped it. It's a, it's a yarn company called Kuka, and it's made in Turkey. You can see here, if you know anything about ice yarns, it has the same font on it as ice yarn, so I'm not sure if they're from the same manufacturer or not, but I did some research and this yarn pretty consistently online, goes for $9.99 each. It's 100% wool. And it's like a really pretty, I call it like fire colors. Is that like a, ch with a charcoal in it? So that's really pretty, what you're getting. And these were $2.99 each, usually 10 bucks a piece. I was really excited to see this because I've never owned ice yarn before. At least I'm fairly sure. And this is, um, ice yarn in tiger alpaca and there were two of them there and they were a dollar 99 each 20 percent alpaca 38 percent wool 32 percent acrylic 10 percent polyamide 50 grams and they're classifying it as a four weight this is kind of like that boucle homespun kind of vibe the colors are like tan and peach, which is cool. And I normally wouldn't 
pick this up if I had like a lot to pick from. But I love alpaca yarn and I've never had ice yarn before and I wanted to show you that sometimes it shows up in thrift stores. Now as far as how much this costs, uh, these were $1.99 each. Ice does not sell these anymore, but I was seeing things on online where you could buy, you know, like a lot of two for like $15. So on my price list, I just put these $5 a piece because ice yarn you can only buy in a pack of, usually it's like a pack of four, a pack of eight, but you have to buy the whole pack. And then shipping usually doubles the cost because it's so cheap on their website. So uh, I'm just going to say these are $5 each. And we're just going to leave it there. So $10 for four. Before I show you the last thing, they also had a ton of acrylic there that was uh, brand new, but some of it, for example, they had some uh, Caron Simply Soft for $2.99 or $3.99. They had a few of those and you could buy it new on sale for just about that price. So I did not think it was worth it, but I wanted to get things that I thought were absolutely worth it. So moving on to the last thing that I found, I've never had this before and I'm really excited. It's the older label, but it is Lion Brand Scarfy. And Lion Brand Scarfy is 78% acrylic, 22% wool. This is in the color, of course they covered it over. Taupe, Crete Taupe maybe. Some of the sticker came off. Made in Turkey, you get 312 yards. And it's like uh, just these pretty taupe colors that I can make something for anybody and it would match. Now, the reason I picked this up, uh, they had it for $2.99 and I've never bought Scarfy because it, they normally sell it for $11.99 and it's rarely on sale. If it is on sale, it's usually, you know, the 30% off or something, 20% off. So uh, this was a great deal for $3.99. $2.99. What am I saying? So all together, one, two, three, four, five, six balls should have been six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Should have been fourteen dollars. So I got up to the front. Again, I've never been to this thrift store before. I got up to the front counter and the lady was so sweet to me um she started ringing up my yarn and then after she rang uh these two she went to ring up this one and she couldn't get it to work so then she started just pressing things around in the computer and then said to me okay that'll be 370 i gave you a good discount and i said 370 for all of it and she said yes and i said thank you and i paid and i left so she put in uh, each skein at 99 cents for five, but there's six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So she didn't even count right. And then she gave me a promotional 25% discount. So each one cost 74 cents, but again, she missed one. So for $3.70, I got $48 worth of yarn from the thrift store. What a freaking good deal. <laughs> this is a great deal. So I just wanted to share it with you because, you know, you might not get a label, but you might know what you're looking at. Or maybe one has a label, maybe one doesn't. Somebody started a project and then donated it. Um, maybe they didn't have enough to finish a whole project or they just decided to donate it. But these are great deals and anyone can build up their yarn stash for very little money. Even at $14 for all of this, it would have been a good deal. But for $3.70, what is that? 61 cents a ball, $11.99, at least $5 a piece, $10 a piece, $5.99. So if you look in your thrift store, you can definitely find some winners. Maybe not all the time, but sometime. And I just wanted to share that with you because I knew that you'd be excited to. Thrift your yarn. That's the way to go. That's the way to build a stash.
that's where all of my yarn comes from. Okay friends, well that is everything I had for you today. This is just a quick unplanned video to show you my spoils and to encourage you to go out and thrift some yarn, show you what's possible. That's the kind of content I like watching anyway, so have a wonderful day and I will see you next time. Bye friends!